Okay, so initially I wanted to make this video to go gradually from me exploring the new lecterns because they made it so we can make the new teleport tabs and so on. But because I eventually I found out something and I want to talk about it right now. Basically, they made it so we can make now ancient teleport tablets and the lunar teleport tablets just in the lectern. So what happened, let's just get into it. But these teleports, like Gorok teleports, right, they're very expensive. And I'm going to assume that you're making the same tabs and they're not going to be different. But they cost so much money. So let's start to buy one of them. Dude, they, they just because of this update, they crashed from 16k to 5k each. All right, but I think it's a little bit different how you make them. So I want to check them out. First of all, let's swap the spell book. I'm guessing that the lectern should be down here for the ancient tablet. So I want to see because they're expensive, dude. They're like 5,000 each. I mean, it requires even less runes to make. There we go. There's a study lectern. That's a new one. You need some soft. Oh, okay. Maybe that's why it's so expensive because it's so hard to get to this place. Only if you have the scepter, it's almost direct teleport. Otherwise, you have to use a camelet. I'm not even sure which ones would be like ideally useful. I'm guessing the Gorok. Because, I mean, it's KBD. It's kind of like deep in the worldy. Like Anakarl. I don't know. Maybe Anakarl, actually. Do people still use that to teleport to Callisto? Because it feels like wilderness crab teleport would be better. However, it's like 23k compared to 5k only okay let's see gorok teleport wait did i buy gorok last time so it goes for 2.5k each oh my god oh um, just look at the price wait do they still have them in lms because then what's the point you have to remove them there's just no point maybe some item and would buy them like if uh well you still have to complete the desert treasure quest it's literally useless then Okay, let's start to buy Anna Carl teleport. It's going for 3.4 thousand. So maybe Anna Carl I will make because it does require blood runes. Yo, this guy's genius. I'm making these tabs right now. And this guy says uh, Anna Carl is going for 16k in the grand exchange, but they're selling for 2.6k. You can put it in the death's coffer. Now, listen, depending on when you're watching this video, this is almost guaranteed it's going to be fixed the next day. Or maybe I. The best case scenario that is going to be fixed on the next update, but I feel like they're going to hot fix it very soon. You can sacrifice items in the death's coffer. So anytime, let's say you don't make it in time, you know, the timer is 15 minutes. You, you know, maybe you're too lazy or you just didn't make it in time. You have to declaim it from the death's office. The current coffer is empty. I'm going to be selecting candles teleports and they're actually going for higher price than the grand exchange. I think by... 5%? I don't know. It just shows like 16.8k as you can see. Now if I do all of them, it's 33.6 million. <laughs> but I only spent what, like 5.8 mil or something? Or not even that, like 5.4 mil? And I, I can confirm this. I'm gonna sacrifice all of these. And now I have in my coffer 33.6 million. Now, obviously, you cannot take it out. It's just when you die, if you have to pay for any of the items, you can use the coffer first. And actually, wait, hold up. What if you die in graves? Wait, I don't get it. It says that my guide risk value is 20 million at the moment. But if I die, I only have to pay 4,000 gold. Now I'm going to pick the nettle. I'm going to die. And hopefully these Vanax items are not going to break. Now, obviously, I did not have any coins in my inventory, so I'm going to loot the remaining. So I obviously paid that 5,000 by from somewhere else. It's either bank or it goes through the debts coffer and it actually it did dude it actually did so if you die i thought it was only when claiming through the death's office like when the gravestone expires and you came to claim from death itself so actually whenever you die i, I didn't know that i made a, a full video on this one i didn't know that thing okay so it's actually useful i should buy as many teleport tabs right now put them in the death's office and if i keep dying like oh no oh no it's two million costs for death it doesn't matter because i probably spent like 250k for that this is the moment this is the moment to buy these teleport tabs okay so i checked the other teleports like padeva but that was like ten thousand, so obviously it's not gonna work it's pretty much at the moment looks like this one is the cheapest one three thousand will cost 48 mil so let's try to buy it what was it three something like 2.8k Something like that. Let's buy another 1k. Yep, that's perfect. And all of them. Just like that. Man. So, his study says that I spent 10.7 million on these teleport tabs. 
Dude, this sells so well. Oh my god. But another got 8,000. I'm not even joking. As I'm making this video, I logged into my alt account just to do like more transactions. Look at this. They reduced it to 10,000. It was 16K before. It is still a lot of money. You can still uh, put in three times more in your debt code. <laughs> <laughs> this is just hilarious i was like I, I was almost speeding to do this like it was like a speed run to do this so it's 80 million i know that it gives you increased amount so if i select this one let's say but how much is it 79k or 79 million i mean then select all of them all and it becomes 83 million five percent increase i think that's what it is so i'm definitely gonna spend this because i spend like nothing on these i literally spent like 30 million or something this is so crazy at the moment it feels but they notice it man i mean it is still three times more it's still doable at the moment all right so today we have a pretty big update happen in runescape as you can see make teleport tablets at the new lunar and ancient lecterns you are now able to make teleport tablets for even like teleport to ice plateau from lunars these look really cool i'm wondering what are the requirements to make them because i know that there was a poll about it but i didn't read it also i don't know if they're even tradable well, how to call them teleport okay let's see if anything new comes up i think they may yeah i think they are untradeable so initially i thought it's going to be in your house where they have to make the tablets but apparently it's somewhere in the island itself and i don't know if it said anything on the website itself i was looking for it for so long that's what it was i was looking through the wrong angle because if you look like this you don't see anything behind i was looking like hmm i don't see anything so it's nice that you don't need any construction level or anything you just complete the quest and you have access to this so let's make the ice split to teleport there we go it shouldn't cost that much money wait how, how many Lorons. Oh, three Lorons to teleport? Is it really that much? Okay, okay. I mean, they're cheap, so the, the tablets should be cheap as well. The thing is that most likely bots cannot have easy access to Lunar Isle. I am not sure how it goes, but it's a pretty high requirement quest. You know, you need mining and so on. So look, it, it shows a Jagex set price at 1000, and it is called Ice Plateau. Ice Pla... It doesn't show up though. <laughs> what okay let's go to grand exchange i want to see what's going on it says wilderness tablet don't accept and i'm gonna shove him an ice split toe teleport so they are tradable it's an oversight hopefully they're gonna fix it today because i wanted to see what kind of money making method this would be wait what if i just do it it said don't accept it here you go ice split toe teleport is he gonna accept it or not he declined it <laughs> He thinks I'm turning to lord him now. So I think they also made some sort of warning. So if I try to teleport now, maybe there's going to be... Nope. <laughs> okay, so they just switch, swap the places. Look, what, the, what is this? Look, there's another guy now. What is going on in this place? And this guy has a raccoon? Wait, this guy may be risking something. Why would you bring it? Even if it's insured, you'll have to pay a lot of money for that. Maybe he didn't notice that he has one. So why do you lord people out here anyways? But if, I, if I'm going to be accused of loading now, because I tried to give the teleport time. Okay, he escaped. I mean, look at this teleport. It says Wilderness Crabs Teleport. So it's clearly the teleport somewhere in Wilderness. However, this one is just a nice name, like a swirly thing as an icon. Ice Plateau Teleport. It doesn't say that it's in Wilderness. It doesn't give you any warnings as well while you try to teleport. So I actually think, judging by me meeting like a couple people there, that something may be going on right now it, it's just too easy to for noobs to teleport i still think you need lunar's isle completed because that's how the ancient teleports used to work all right so rune pouch also works so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make a lot of caterbite teleports hopefully they're gonna fix it because I, I assume they should be tradable on the grand exchange i feel like this would be the most needed because it has a hair patch so if any of you are using like a bunch of teleport tablets because uh, you know when i do farm runs i like to use teleport tablets instead of normal teleports unless i'm on my iron man so i feel like these should be the most expensive ones so let's make a thousand teleport tablets let's see how long it's actually gonna take and how much money i'm going to profit from this okay so if you price check the tablet itself it's 1.1k which cannot be true because you need three law runes three astral runes 
10 water wounds and also soft clay which pretty much averages like but that would be like such a little profit however if you look at this right now on the screen you do get magic experience by creating tabs i it's approximately 1000 tabs an hour and the experience is pretty good it's more like uh, more than high alking which I, I hope nobody does nowadays. I, ho I, I literally hope nobody high Alex for the magic experience. It is AFK. You're getting magic experience. You could get like 1.5 mil magic XP a day. But I do assume that this should sell for profit. Yo, look at this. I saw the escape, so I equipped my untrimmed. And I just went in the front, you know, like, you know, it's like a little bit different. Look at, look at the names. This guy has alt accounts for Corporal Beast, I assume. That is so all of them 126 jesus man how much time did it now because there's only 10,000 limit on the tabs i actually left the offer on my other account so i'm gonna trade everything back there's gonna be some nice tab i'm gonna i'm gonna put everything into my desk offer but yeah those uh, luna teleport tabs that i made i couldn't sell them because they just simply not tradable in the grand exchange at this very moment wait i only checked the carol teleport didn't i it was yeah okay 10,000. what about sinister teleport 6k oh my god dude that was okay it wasn't that much it was 13k or something literally just now maybe half an hour ago when i left the offer i went afk you know and i come back i log in uh, how much is uh calendar this was also 16k okay this was probably this is doing the best out of all right now you can actually if it still goes to like 3k each you can pretty much have the same profit as i did in the beginning of, the, of this video and then we got lasad teleport this was also going for around 16k dude and this one look i i showed you the price you know it was it was 16k i'm just i'm mad because i did not use it in the correct moment i had my chance and i didn't use it but let's select everything let's Oh, they fix it so hard. Not only they reduce the price, but it says unacceptable item. Oh my lord. All of them. <laughs> wait, 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 cattle is acceptable? Okay, so cattle is, is still acceptable? What? Uh, okay, I'm gonna spend all cattle. Lassar is not acceptable. Anakal is not acceptable. Sinistan no dude i had so much of this no, who's gonna buy this it's like terrible teleport <laughs> this one is also acceptable calendar okay so it still goes for 14.5k each i'm gonna check the ge for one last time because two teleports as you can see is 30k and my coffer is going up and up but i barely spent any money on this of course i spent like 30 million by this point but it's nice to save up because who knows maybe there's gonna be some weird boss eventually in the future where you need a lot of deaths and claiming your items from uh, why am i teleporting anyway i'm logging off now thank you very much for watching hope you enjoyed it and uh hey take advantage i don't know the prices right now because they seem to change a lot but there's still one teleport tab either make it make as much as you can make the tablets themselves i mean at the temple and it's like three four million gp an hour right now or sacrifice them if they do sell in the grand exchange there's this is amazing money making method right now or the coffer i mean i have over 130 mil right now anyway thank you very much for watching and i'll see you very soon bye i should do this on my iron man oh wait it's hardcore iron man i am not supposed to die and then use the gp to claim my items yes good night